Somebody's thirsty. Uh oh, I've been spotted. But you're still drinking. What is going on guys? Welcome back to another night here in the snake room. Will Nace. Tonight we do have a very special night because tonight we're feeding these four cages that you see here. We have the big Burmese python who will be getting three jumbo rats. We have the king cobra which you'll have to wait till the end to see his food. Um, we have the three eastern diamondback rattlesnakes and the two bigger mexican west coast rattlesnakes. So these snakes uh, with the exception of these guys these two get some of the biggest meals here in the snake room. Uh, so we're definitely going to be feeding them and hopefully teaching you guys some new stuff. So we're changing stuff up. Now normally I do have the red bowl, but uh, we just got donated a bunch of green buckets for myself and red buckets for summer for the foxes. So now we'll be doing feedings, but with green buckets instead of a red bowl. But we're going to go ahead and feed the Burmese python first. He's getting three jumbo rats. So this is going to be fun because he takes all three. I'm not going to film him eating all three of them because it will take a very, very long time. Look at you already ready. You're already ready. You know what's coming, don't you? You already know. You're not even going to let me get this rat near you. Look at the balls against the glass. They're veiny and hairy. That's so gross. <laughs> if you actually come on over here, you can look. Uh, he did grab that head perfectly. We like to call that the money shot here on YouTube. So I'm placing two more of these guys in here just simply for him. Um, he will eat them once he's done with those guys. And that's it for him. He's pretty simple, pretty easy. Burmese python, sick, awesome, love him. Of course, you two are tucked together. So in here, we have the two Mexican West Coast rattlesnakes. We have Wasabi, which is the big male, and the beautiful female, which produce the babies. So these guys are also getting the jumbo rats as well. Nice big meal for them. Trip, 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 trip. So I just got news on all the babies that I did sell for them too. Um, all the babies are doing fantastic. So I'm very happy with that. I love when, oh, come on, Wasabi, come on, Wasabi. Oh, nice. Good boy. All right, so there's Wasabi's. Now, if you guys come on over here and look really close, you can actually see his one fang on the left side kind of piercing the head there. Last time she didn't strike at the meal. Um, ever since she dropped the babies, her attitude has been different. Her appetite has been different. Um, completely understandable. It happens to a lot of pregnant women as well. But um, so yeah, I'm just going to leave it in there next to her. I'm going to keep an eye on her, see if she does start eating it or not. If Wasabi goes over and tries to eat it after he's done with his, I will pull it out of there and probably separate her uh, and feed her another later time tonight. So they're done. Now we got to do the Eastern Diamondback Rattlesnakes. All right, so now because I do have three in here, 
it's a little difficult feeding them. You might have heard me say in a past video um, that especially the one female, Savannah, she kind of takes her time eating. So I like to pull her and Kratos out um, and set them in separate totes so they can eat by themselves and Venom won't come over and steal their food. Because Venom is a very fat rattlesnake. So we're going to go ahead and separate them out. Let's see. Oh, the two I need to pull out are right here in the corner. So this is Kratos. I've been working a lot with Kratos. Um, I'll actually play a video for you guys really quick so you can check out what I've been working on him with. So yeah, super cool. I've uh, been spending a lot of time with this one particular rattlesnake. All of my rattlesnakes are relatively tame. Um, a lot of that has to do with handling, how you handle your rattlesnakes. Uh, if you handle your rattlesnakes crappy, they're gonna be crappy towards you. So she's very food aggressive. She absolutely loves her meals. So I'm actually gonna film this in slow motion for you guys so you can see how fast she actually is. Man, that's crazy. Now talk about fast. She is super fast. A lot of the rattlesnakes are. The berm has already started eating his rats. This is a good sized meal for him. Usually I feed him rabbits, but I'm changing up his diet a little bit, giving him some rats every now and then too. He also will get some chicken as well. Switching it up is always a good thing. So we're gonna go ahead and feed the other two rattlesnakes really quick. All right, so first we're gonna feed Kratos. So these guys are both getting two small rats for right now. Hey buddy. Now I normally don't pull him when I am feeding. So he's he's a little weirded out right now about being in this tub. So I actually might not get a strike from him, but that's okay. So I'm just gonna leave two rats in here for him. He will eat them, I'm not worried about it. Uh, normally I do just pull a savanna out, which is this one here. I usually just let these sit in there. Um, she has always, since the beginning, given me like a problem eating. Um, but once I figured out if I just leave them in there, left alone, she kind of just eats them. She'll be fine with it. So you're just gonna smell it and that's it. All right. Perfect, 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 perfect. So we're getting everybody fed up. We still have one snake left to feed. But this one's gonna be fun. So on the menu today for Anubis, which is the Indonesian King Cobra, um, you guys have seen me try so many different things with him. This is the first time I'm trying this. Uh, this is actually a reticulated python that has been dead for, I wanna say, about eight months now or so. Um, so he's been in a freezer, so we're gonna go ahead and try and feed him. Now this is part of his natural diet, so I'm really hoping he does eat this snake. You ready? Are you ready? Oh, I'm ready. I wasn't asking you, Logan. Just you two. Just you two. So now we also did just clean his cage, so I don't know if he's going to be in the mood to eat. Oh, oh, that's a bite. That's a bite and a take. He took it. Hopefully you guys are seeing this, because I'm not. So awesome. Man, he didn't even wait to eat that thing. Come over here, Logan. 
So he's definitely munching on this thing. This is a very good sign. I've actually tried to feed him chicken a couple times since the last time he ate a piece of chicken and he has not eaten it. So I'm extremely happy that he's gonna get this meal in him. I mean, this is a very good sign. So I actually just recently covered up the other side of his uh, cage a little bit more too because he has been smashing his face more now than he was in the beginning. So I wanted to make sure he doesn't do that. So right now he's just, I think he's working his way down the wrong end. Is he going the right way? Oh yeah, he's, he's going, the, he's right going way. the right way. Okay. So walking his fangs down the body of this snake. So perfect. So he's definitely comfortable eating frozen thawed now, which is a very good sign because of the fact that when I first got him, he would only eat live snakes. So he would bite, hang on for a very long time until that snake was dead. But now he's biting the snake and just immediately starting to work his way down the body. So freaking awesome. All right, guys, that is going to be it for this feeding video. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. <sighs> so many large rats, so many large snakes. He's still on the first one. He's not even done with the first one yet, which I'm shocked because usually he hounds meals. The king cobra, I'm not going to sit here and film the whole thing. You guys have seen him eat and many other king cobras eat on YouTube. So I'm not going to film the whole thing, but hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Remember, subscribe if you are not already. Smash that like button if you haven't already. Poof. Just like that. It's easy, simple, quick, fast. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the next video like always. Bye.